Good day, my name is Sharon. I'm a trainer in Palot Products. On this training video, I would like to showcase how one can be able to calibrate the IR board. So this is your IR board, of which when it comes to your IR board, for it to be able to work, you are having a board, you're having a projector, and you're having a computer. So on your computer, you have drivers, which we call the touch drivers, that allow you to make sure that whatever you are doing on your computer is accurately synced to your board or the image on your board. For you to calibrate, you come to your hidden icons here and you click on your driver's icon. So the driver's icon should always be saying connected. When it says connected, it means that your board and your computer are communicating or you can now be able to manipulate your computer on the board. As you can see, here, I can be able to manipulate my computer on the board, but where I am pointing and where the, the mouse is are on different positions. So for you to be able to make sure that as you point, your mouse is exactly on the image that you're pointing, you do what we call calibration. So let's do this process together. Come to your hidden icons and select your driver icon. Click on the driver icon and select Calibrate. So on your calibration window, you will see that you are given four points, nine points by default, 21 points. For you to be more precise, you can select 21 points. When you select your 21 points, you click Calibrate. It gives you 21 points that you can now be able to use to set up the coordinates such that your computer remembers the positions of your image that is being projected. So let's quickly do that by pressing and holding, you get your coordinates and you do for each and every position. Right. After setting up your calibration points, you also set up the hotkeys of Teach Infinity. These hotkeys are shortcut icons of functionality of Teach Infinity that we are going to look at on our next uh, stage of the video. So let's up, let us set up. It says touch the top one. So we click the top and then the bottom one. Again, the top part and the bottom part, and your calibration will be completed. After calibrating, you can now be able to interact with applications that are on your computer. So for example, if I want to come and open a, a OneNote document, when I click there, it should respond on that particular OneNote. That is how you set up your IR board, and you can now go on to Teach Infinity. Thank you.